Hi hey everybody, this is Carl from CarlSapsy.com and today I'm going to be showing you another Python tutorial about Python casting. So if you want to check out any of my other tutorials, feel free to go to my website, CarlSapsy.com or you can, where you can also see my HTML tutorials and my upcoming Python tutorials. Or if you want to, feel free to check out my um, YouTube channel because I post everything to there. Okay, so the first thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be doing something called H. Uh, we're going to be doing something called Python casting, in which we're going to try and find out how we can make a program that can give us the area of a circle. The first thing we want to do is to do a basic. Let's first of all start with the basics and do a basic multiplication sum using a variable. To do this, let's first declare a variable such as number and make this equal to an input because we're going to be inputting some information in a string and we're going to say um, what is your number question mark and and then close your brackets and your quotation marks so now let's say we wanted to mo and so let's say once we get our answer let's call this a and s we want to multiply number the answer we get on uh, the value we're going to assign to number and let's multiply this by 5 and then in our when we're going to print to the console log which is here we're going to print um, hey your number multiplied by 5 is colon and the speech marks and then we're going to add the number uh, we're going to add the answer sorry we're going to add the answer variable so now let's press F5 make sure your module is saved and now let's in the console log we're given a uh, question saying what is your number so I'm going to say the number is 6 press enter and now what comes up it says hey your number multiplied by 5 is 66666 well it really should be 30 so what's actually gone wrong here well the first thing we have to do is we can leave this as it is but in your answer if you remember in our first tutorial or in my second tutorial where I've put uh, a basic multiplication if you don't bracket your number what will happen is it will multiply the actual value and it will replicate it this many times so in this case five times another thing to note in this particular case is the fact that we are going to be multiplying an integer so we're going to be using the integer function so we're going to put answer is equal to the integer of the number and we're going to multiply this by five now when we print it we want to print this in a string format so all we're going to do here is in your in your print uh, line we're going to put str open bracket and then answer and then at the very end we're going to close it because now you have to close the brackets at the start and at the end as well as the answer brackets so now let's uh, press run f5 ok and it says what is your number again so let's put in 6 so now when it, what comes up is hey your, uh, your number multiplied by 5 is 30 so what it's done here it's multiplied the value of the integer 6 and has multiplied it by 5 and it's given it in our string format and that's all there is to a basic multiplication sum um, the next thing we're going to be focusing on now is how we can simply find the area of a basic circle so to do this in general the area of a circle as I'm sure most of you would know is pi times radius and then that squared which will be this times 2 so in the language of Python rather than uh, we don't have this symbol to make it squared the in Python we are going to be using this. So the star star sign is a symbol for powers and in this case we're going to be timesing it to the power of 2. Let's also take the value of pi as 3.141 for this particular scenario, for this particular case. Uh, and 
now we're going to find the area of a circle. So let's first of all change the rate. Uh, let's change what is your number to what is your length of the radius. And then we're going to put over here the in the integer number. We're going to star star this by two. So we're going to square the radius value and times it by pi. So that is uh, 3.141 as we said. And we can leave the print as the same because it's going to print to the same place and we want it to print as uh, hey your area of the circle is. So now let's run the module and it says what is your length of the radius so let's put it as full and what will come up is it will say your area of hey your area of the circle is 50.256 so all it's done here is it's given us a float number because it's a decimal number and we've inputted the number of 4 effectively here it's multiplied 4 to, uh, to the power of 2 which is 16 and this has been multiplied by 3.141 and then this comes out to the value of 50.256 and then when we've printed it we are simply printing out in a string format the answer to this entire sum and now you know how to find the area of a circle thank you very much for uh, watching uh, I'm Carl from carlsapti.com